My name is Honorable Barista Ejai from Mizo Debala. I'm a lawyer, businessman, and politician. I'm a former member of the People's Democratic Party. Now I'm a member of the All Progressive Congress. One of the things that really annoy me, even though after it happened, I still remain a member of the party because I was still hopeful that the candidate of Sheriff would be removed in court. Was that a night after a lot after I gone to all the local government area of Delta State, seeing delegates and doing everything. A night to the primaries, Senator Ifa Yokoa called me on the phone and informed me that oh, this, how are you? I say fine. Say please, you are going to be the next governor of Delta State. Tomorrow, when you are coming to the feed, please dress very well because you are going to give a press conference to accept. Your, your nomination as the candidate of the party. And I was happy and he called the phone. Then we went to the field. Then Okowa and his agents massively bribed all the delegates to vote for Sheriff. Even though I'm not against Sheriff, but the call of Okowa and the betrayal of Okowa was very painful. Then after then, he went to church to go and dance that he has defeated us, telling me clearly that I was his enemy. Then since that time till now, none of them has come to see me. I'm still the one running after them. I left the People's Democratic Party because the arrangement of the People's Democratic Party is dead on arrival. Infant Yokowa, the governor of Delta State, does not have respect for me and my followers, and does not have the respect for the people of Delta State. In 2014, 2015, when he was coming in as governor, then I was the council chairman for separate local government. The then governor of Delta State, Dr. Emmanuel Wita Odwan, wanted Tony Obu to be governor of Delta State. But I myself, and if I have Festus Ovia Gas, and myself will form myself into a team to support Senator Dr. Ifan Yokoa. Of the 25 local government chairmen in Delta State that supported that, uh, then, then they were all supporting Dr. Emmanuel Wita Odwan, who had the party structure. But I, as the old member of the party, so the quality of Okowa and I supported him 100%. I brought in friends who donated money to him in 2014. One of our leaders in Delta State, Chief S.L. Olotu, gave me money which I gave to Okowa directly in the presence of Chief S.L. Olotu. S.L. Olotu. Another of my friends in Abuja, one Mr. Sajiri, brought a lot of money and I want to give it to Kowa directly. Uh, one of my young boys in America, his name is Victor. I don't want to mention his son name or anything. He gave us over ten thousand dollars which we give to Senator Dr. Ifan Okowa to support his governmental ambition. I had direct quarrels with Senator with the Dr. Emmanuel Wita at that time in supporting Senator Dr. Ifan Okowa to be governor. When he became governor, I became, I don't know what happened. I'm the one going to meet them. What the hell? Who did they think they are? Who did they think they are? Going to Wafta, to Rugumi, to Kowa. Okowa will not even pick your call. I will come more than 100 times. He will not respond. Then I say, he will not even talk well. People are appointing SASSAPA everywhere. I cannot appoint SAPA and they say I'm a big man in PDP. I have my boys, I have my followers all over the state. So I just decided that, what the hell, go to where you are appreciated.